Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I thought I would do an update on my arm lift and bra roll excision since we are on day seven post-op. So one week ago today, I had um, the surgery. As you can see, my arms are uncovered right now. Um, the doctor wants me to air them out three or four times a day just so <clears throat> the incisions can get some air and stuff. So you can kind of see going on where the incisions are um this doesn't hurt my armpits hurt so bad like oh my god they hurt so bad there's stitches in my armpits and uh like anywhere I move like I can feel them pulling I get them out on Monday thank god so hopefully like I'll be able to put my arms further down <laughs> Once those are out, because right now, like, I'm having to literally, like, walk around like this. Um, but, yeah, other than that, I normally only take pain meds for three days after a surgery or something because I'm so scared that, like, they're highly addictive and stuff. So um, I have a rule for myself that I usually only take them for three days. Well, this surgery has been more painful than I anticipated, I have cried more in the last week than I've probably cried in 10 years. Um, so at this point, I'm down to like half of a pain pill, max twice a day, but yesterday was only once. Um, the mornings are usually like the fucking shittiest. So I've been sleeping in this recliner for the past week because I can't like lay down and put my arm, like it's so uncomfortable. And we only have a queen bed, so there's not enough room to put, like, two piles of pillows next to me and have Jared sleep in bed. So I've just been sleeping in the recliner. So my appetite is pretty much back to normal at this point. Um, but other than that, like, there's no real stuff to report. I got my drains out on Monday, so that was day four post-op so the drains were only in for like barely three days because I got them out Monday morning um and the swelling is still crazy but it's getting better every day obviously like the first couple days my hands were like so swollen um especially the right one um and this one still gets more swollen than the left but the swelling just in my hands alone has gone down a bunch. Um, you can see kind of like there's some puckering going right here on my skin and that's due to swelling. So as the swelling goes away, this will all like flatten out right there. This arm is better. Um, but yeah, everything is super tight. Like I'm afraid to, like my arms don't go higher than this cause like I'm afraid of what would happen if they did. But yeah, that's what's going on right now. The incisions on my side, I will show once the tape gets taken off, which I assume will be Monday. Um, I did get to shower for the first time the night that the drains came out. So that was really exciting and made me feel so much better. I do have little zaps of nerve stuff shooting through my arms at various times throughout the day doesn't seem to matter like what I'm doing it'll just be like a random zip um I feel the most pain by my left elbow for whatever reason like the nerves there are like crazy but yeah um my arms initially before surgery were 16.75 inches on one side and 17 inches on the other side I can't remember which side is which um, but now they're both at 15 inches, so down two inches in one, 1 1.75 in the other, and they're still super swollen. So they should go down from there over the next weeks, months, whatever. Uh, the day after surgery, my weight went up like seven pounds overnight from like all the fluid and crazy stuff. Uh, but now it's back down to like 0.2 below where I was before surgery. So that's tapered off over the week. Um, hopefully that'll still continue to go down because I am still swollen. Uh, I do plan to get a lymphatic massage to help speed up the de-swelling situation. 
but I'm not going to do that until I can drive myself because it doesn't make sense to like pay for an Uber to take me. So, but that's what's going on. If you have any questions, leave them below. Otherwise I'll do an update maybe at two weeks and let you guys know how things are going. So yeah, see you later.